spread. It is time for our two faithful to fill devotional with Pastor Charles and Pastor Mrs. Deborah Charles Osazua. Today is Monday, the 29th day of July, 2024. Our topic is Use Things, Love Humans. Our anchor scripture reads, Beloved, let us love one another, for love is of God, and everyone that loveth is born of God, and knoweth God. 1 John 4 verse 7 As Christians, we must remember that things are meant to be used, and not to be cherished as ends in themselves. While people are meant to be cherished and loved, this phrase implies that we are not meant to just use people to achieve our aims or goals and then abandon them once we achieve our desires. But we are to see people in the image of God and as vessels that God uses to achieve His purpose in our lives. Those God used to achieve His purpose for our lives are to be loved and cherished. They are not meant to be seen as tools or gateways to reach our destinations. God calls us to a higher purpose, to love one another as He has loved us. When we focus on using things wisely and loving people wholeheartedly, we align ourselves with God's plan. In Matthew 6 verse 19 to 21, Jesus teaches us not to lay up treasures on earth, but to lay up treasures in heaven. Our focus should be on eternal matters, not fleeting pleasures. By prioritizing relationships and loving others, we build treasures in heaven. When we use things without allowing them to become idols in our lives, we are free to love others as God intends. We find fulfillment not in the accumulation of possessions, but in the depth of our relationships with God and others. Take time today to assess your priorities. Are you valuing things over people? Remember that true joy and purpose come from loving others and using things for God's glory. Let us pray. Please say after me, Lord, thank you for reminding us that things are meant to be used, but humans are meant to be loved. Help us to prioritize our relationships with you and with others. Praise God. Let's take the confession together. Guide us in using the blessings you have given us to bless those around us. Praise God. I thank you for being part of this morning devotion. I believe God from what you have taken in through the word of God today. As you step out, your day is blessed, your week is blessed, your family is blessed. In the mighty name of Jesus. We will be doing this again tomorrow morning. Stay tuned. God bless you.